welcome back again to another video if you're new here my name is natia on this channel i actually share a lot of uh, natural ingredients of how you can make them in your comfort home and use them to grow your hair and your baby girl's hair so if you guys want to see um a lot of my videos you can just scroll down you are gonna see a lot of videos uh of all this natural ingredient of how you can make them to use them to grow your hair so in today's video i'm just gonna be styling my baby girl's hair um i haven't really styled her hair on my channel i'm i'm just only making the videos like making all the ingredients and using it to grow her hair but i actually have not done any styling videos on my channel so i just decided to you know record this video today and just post it today for you guys to see so we are going to be doing a little bit of style and i'm just going to be cornrows her hair i want to cornrows everything all back because we are going to holidays i just don't want anything that will disturb me on our holidays you know i just want her to be free and me to be free as well so yeah so yeah i'm going to be cutting the front as you guys can see i will just be cutting the front like a zizzard there crossing and then i will be cutting this side i will part this side like this and i'm just gonna do like all back and uh, just kind of do a little bit of a uh, style there in front and so that the front would be like a you know zizzard uh, kind of style so her hair is already clean uh, we washed the hair in the evening so um i was like okay let me just do another style the style that i did last week was not that good and the hair was just coming out and it, it was not neat because she was not letting me she was not sitting the way she's sitting here right now <laughs> last week was not good for her hair at all she didn't let me do her hair obviously she was crying around and um so the style was not looking nice so everything was just coming out if you know what i mean so yeah my guys my baby girl's hair is very very soft and light so you always have to know uh the type of uh, protective style that you have to be doing on her hair otherwise <laughs> the hair will last only one week if it's too long <laughs> minimum one week okay so her hair style doesn't last at all <laughs> so i always uh, try to cornrows her hair like this or i can just do like a, a braid on her hair a braid is also last on her hair all these kind of cornrows which she also love as well so this is the style that i always like to be doing on her hair otherwise the other style doesn't last if i do like a ponytail and nice beautiful ponytail um after three days i have to be read like to be touching her hair all the time i actually don't like to be touching her hair like all the time frequently you guys know that too much of hair manipulation is not good so you have to have at least a protective style that can last you for one week at least one to two weeks before you can go ahead and manipulate your hair again so it's always good to have this type of protective style maybe cornrows or you just braid your hair so i basically cannot twist her hair because her hair doesn't last yes the hairstyle would not last so all i do is either way i put it on the cornrows like this or i can just um you know do like um a braid on her head a braid also lasts a lot so these are the style that can really last her for up to one week or up to two weeks on her head if you're new here you are welcome thank you so much for sticking around on this channel like i said before i do share a lot of natural ingredient of how you can use them to grow your hair guys all these ingredients are working if you'll be watching my videos you literally can see that um the, the journey of how we started and where we are right now or <laughs> how all these ingredients have been helping me to grow my hair thicker and uh, you know longer and healthier and also my baby girl's hair from being so thin to to 
being so thick and having these volumes and healthy, you know, if you know what I mean. So you just have to be consistent with all these ingredients. They do work, okay? If you're consistent using them and if you believe in yourself, believe in your hair, trust your hair, leave your hair alone, our hair do grow. Yes, our hair do grow. To see a massive result, you, you have to give your hair at least three to four months yes three to four months you can see a massive result all these people that you see they are they have a long hair on social media it's not one month hair growth is the hair have been like if you ask them how how old is your hair they will tell you 10 years five years seven years eight years 10 11 12 15 years yes it can take up to that uh to that long period before you can start seeing a massive like really really growth of your hair and also protective style play a lot of roles on our hair and if you have a protective style as well so try not to put leave your protective style for too long yes i've also noticed that as well for one of my friends she always live in her protective style for three months i would be like what <laughs> three months of course the hair will grow during that period your hair will definitely grow but if you are taking out the the protective style you will experience a lot of breakage and you will experience a lot of you know your hair will be coming out and that hair that you just grow at the end of the day you're gonna end up losing all of them you will have a lot of shades and your hair will break out yes so if you really want to minimize shading like that you always have to leave your protective style at least at least one month i would say one month so for me because i know how to do my hair which i know that doing hair is not that cheap is very expensive so because i know how to you know do all my protective styles so i leave my hair for like two weeks three weeks and i can take it out and do another style if i want but for those of you who always go to salon to spend money on doing your hair i know that is expensive so you can leave it at least one month two months and if you know that it's easy to also treat your scalp or to wash your hair and to moisturize your hair you can also be doing that yes if you do like a braid a braid you can actually wash and moisturize and still add some oil and still add some uh you know moisturizer to to protect it from from dryness because when you have a protective style and your hair is dry it's gonna lead it's gonna lead to a lot of breakage and it's gonna lead to a lot of like you're gonna lose a lot at the end of the day so you just have to know the type of protective style that can really protect your hair even though it's three months or two months but you still have to be you know managing the the moisturizing on it and you still have to be taking care of it taking care of your roots and washing your roots and cleaning your scalp the whole time if you guys know what i mean so yeah that's it and another thing like when you are taking it out you have to spray water before you ending up taking it out and don't just take your hair don't just uh take your hair out when it's dry you have to spray water on it you have to use some conditioner so that all the uh, product build up can be released it can be you know kind of soft before you go ahead and and take out your protective style if you're also going too rough with your protective style and if you are taking it out you're also going to end up losing your hair so these are the things that are, can really help you uh, protecting your hair and also you can see a lot of length you can retain length during the protective style if you don't know how to manipulate the length that you just retain you can end up taking the, all of them down and your hair um your hair length will just remain the same yes or either way it can even look shorter <laughs> your hair will still look shorter than it used to be before so we really have to know how to manipulate your hair if you really want to grow your hair i managed to put my baby girl's hair on a protective style guys she was really patient this time <laughs> so a lot of you are like you always tell me in the comment section oh my gosh she's so nice she's so patient yeah she is patient and say that but sometimes she would just be on her mood and i really give her a good a 
kudos because there are even some adults who doesn't even like people to touch their hair. I have friends that don't even want you to touch their hair. Every small thing, beam, they will already be crying. But my baby girl, he, she can just sit down and let me braid her hair. But then I tell her when it's hurting you, you tell mama, okay? She will say, okay, mommy. So yeah, she did a good job and we ended up having this tie and I am loving it and she's loving it as well. And she's so appreciative. She always run to the mirror and check herself. She will be like, oh, mommy, thank you. I love it. I love you, mommy. Yeah, and I say, yeah, one day I will teach you how it works so that you can be doing it by yourself. So that's it. And I hope you guys like and enjoy this video. If you have watched to this extent, please do not forget to give us some like subscribe share thank you once again in the meantime hope to catch you all on my next one much love bye bye